I was told that they had fixed my closet doors. They didn't fix my closet doors. There was track there before for these closet doors. You understand? Now we have these ugly things. And if you look in my old videos, you will see that those weren't there before. Okay? That's just the easy way out to put these ugly silver things. And I had actually been contemplating... Um, my mom had said a long time ago about getting ones like she has, mirrored doors, and now if we wanted to do that, there's no track there. You know what I mean? They put these ugly things, and that was their solution. I was told they fixed my closet doors. They didn't. That's their fucking solution, these people. And by the way, I know I can look at my old videos. In fact, I'll put a link to one of my old dancing videos, and you guys can see for yourself. You can pause it at X amount of time, and you can see that these things were not there before, okay? So they went cheap, cheap, cheap. That's their solution to get my closet doors on there. When there was track there before that they had to rip up, they should have put track back down. You understand? That's what they should have fucking done. And I feel hurt and betrayed by all of this shit. Okay? I feel hurt and betrayed by somebody I liked. But the church woman is going to badmouth this company. She has, she, in, in her line of work, you know, I mean, she, she meets a lot of different people and she's active in her church community. And you know damn well she's going to badmouth these people. Okay? That's their fucking solution. There was track there before. I said, I know it wasn't like that before. If they had to take my closet doors out and rip up that track, they should have put closet, you know what I mean? Not put these stupid little things and stick out. That's their solution. This fucking little thing that sticks out is their solution. Okay? I know... But actually, I had to look at videos to see, okay? The bedrooms were designed the same, right? It had track down. It did not, you know what I mean? And then my doors were coming loose from that track. This is my mom's bedroom or whatnot. You had to rip it all up. You don't just put down flat things and put down a stupid thing that sticks out. Now, if I wanted those doors again, you know, if I wanted these kind of doors, my mom has mirrored doors, they would have to, whoever installed them would have to actually put down track and rip up, I mean, I'm fucking believable. Unbelievable. They went the cheap, cheap route. The cheapest they could do is what they did. Those things were not there before. That's a cheap little contraption. That's a cheap fucking little contraption. That, that, that you know, instead of put, putting down new track and getting these doors to work, that was their solution. Put down this cheap little thing. A nail. Who has that in their closet? Seriously. It wasn't there before. It's just cheap. It's just fucking, you know, that's a cheap, cheap way to go. There was track here before for these doors. Not this stupid thing. I can show you. I can show you guys. Okay? I thought they fixed my closet doors, not finagled it. They're freaking contractors. They're trying to go cheap, 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 but they could have justified it. You know? Not had it be look chintzy like that. This is what it used to look like. Look at this. This is one of my videos. Nothing sticks out. I used to lean against there. I knew there was nothing like that that stuck out. That was their solution. Instead of putting track back down and making the doors work, they put those stupid things. 
They were most definitely not there before, as you can see from this video. You can see clearly there's not this little thing sticking out, is there? That you see sticking out, okay? And fucking believable. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. I was betrayed by this entire process from start to fucking finish, okay? Because it started with the field adjuster giving me two days. I had been trying to find a contract. She was like, well, we started this claim and you need to get the ball rolling. I'm going away and you have until this day, which was two days after I was talking to her, when I told her I had been trying. I had been trying and trying and trying. And in the end, she forced me to take the first person who called me, okay? There was track here before. Track. And then say you put down these fucking sheep contraption things. Fuck you. If you couldn't get my closet doors to work with track, you get new closet doors. You know what I mean? You don't put down something different and put those ugly things that stick out. That's not real. That's not, it doesn't work correctly. Fuck you. Fuck you. And this can't possibly be right. It just can't. That goes straight through. I can stick a piece of paper straight through to the back. So I'm assuming this contraption, this cheap-ass contraption was, was straight to stud and not the glued kind. I don't know. But I know that she had said something about there being a stud right here where they, they put up the grab bar, okay? See, it's on this side, too. And they felt like this was sufficient. And my mother, someone like her, anyone like her, that's what breaks my heart, wouldn't fucking know any better. Wouldn't know any better. Okay? Wouldn't fucking know any better. And then under there, you can't see it, but it's all sticky. And, and there's glue and gross stuff under here where I put in my fingers. I don't know what you guys can see under there. But I am hurt and betrayed that this woman doesn't bother to examine the final product, carefully examine the work of her, her beloved to her employees, okay? I am so fucking pissed. That was their solution, to put down these fucking ugly contraptions. Okay? That were not there before, as you can clearly see in my video. Those were not there sticking out like that before. That was their solution. Meanwhile, there was track here before. And if the closet doors weren't correctly staying on the track, you fix that. You don't put down crappy shit in place of what was there before. <sighs> Unfucking believable. Unbelievable. <laughs> There's a vision. You have to rip off my thing. You put down the same fucking thing and you make it work. You don't put ugly contraptions just to finagle it. That's somebody that would do that if it's not, you know, if they're, they, that is not how that was before. You saw these stupid things were not there. These stupid, ugly little contraptions. Cheap, cheap, cheap. They didn't fix my closet doors. They lied. That's their solution, to finagle it, to put just plain stuff down, okay, that definitely was not there before. It was track that was there before. And their solution, instead of putting down track that was there before and then making it work however you had to do it, no. The solution was to do these cheap little contraptions that stick out and that are you're just finagling it. That's all. Look, just finagling it.
when it was on track before. It was on a track, a long track. It's bullshit. It's fucking bullshit. It's bullshit. Oh my god. She sits there and tells me it has to be the way that it, that it was before, yeah. If that's the case, you would have had to put track back down like within my mom's bedroom. Fucking assholes. This is what was in. I know damn well. There was some kind of track there in my bedroom, okay? There was. The pictures prove it, even if I couldn't remember. The videos prove it. And the doors were falling off of that track. That doesn't mean you just do some stupid contraption like you did. You know? But they had to get them to go back on. That's the thing. And they were on even if they were bad on the track. I could have had them fixed. Now they ripped up the floor and didn't put track back down in my closet. They put that stupid cheap strip and that stupid thing that sticks out and that's supposed to suffice. Unreal. Unfucking believable. Betrayed. That's how I feel. Fucking betrayed. Betrayed. <sighs> Wanna see. I caught glimpses of that before when I didn't know if it was catching it with the camera. But there's a crapshoot. You don't know if it's catching anything. You understand? You just don't know. That. I can't possibly be how it's supposed to be. And like I said, down there, where you can see down there, even hours and hours after I'd taken a shower, water was all dripping down through here. Okay? droplets of water and it's all gross under there. It's all sticky like. The fact is any contractor can finagle a job. You understand? It can finagle it. So on the surface it looks good and a poor ignorant, you know, someone who's just like my mom wouldn't question anything, doesn't want to cause trouble, you know? And then you, you go on your merry way as a contractor and, and your client's happy and they don't know any better. There was track there before. I know there was. And if I didn't know, I have proof of it. There was track there. Okay? That's what people have. Where a closet slide door slides on two tracks. Not this fucking bullshit cheap contraption that sticks out. You can see from my old videos that it was not fucking like that. That was their solution to making this work instead of, you know, fixing it. They would have been justified in fixing it. The insurance wouldn't have had anything to say about it. If it was tracked there before, you had to take my closet doors off that track, you need to put track back down, and if you can't make my closet doors work and you're not able to do it, you do it like you would do a brand new house or something. Like you said, you work with million dollar houses. Yeah. You work with million dollar houses and can't get this relative, comparatively cheap mobile home. You know, you just did it half assed. <laughs> so fucking heartbreaking. Like I said, my mother would be standing in the shower. And even if it dawned on her, okay, like I was doing, washing my hair, you know, standing with face away from the, the, the water pounding on my head. And I'm thinking, how can, I've never been in a shower before that's like that. How can that be right? That can't be right. What the fuck?
How can that be right? That's like that. My comments about my mom would be like, well, the contractors were nice and they know what they're doing. It's, you know, what kind of tub has a big gap like that? Where is it going to behind there, you know? And that's what I don't know. I don't know. Is it attached to something behind there? So is it not reaching the walls? Is it a glued on? Is it a stud? I can't tell that, people. But it does, you know, I've never been in a shower that, that had that like that of you. I never have in my life. And I pay attention to shit. But I know even if it doesn't get, for whatever reason, pretend it just doesn't get any water behind there. It doesn't hit the wall. You don't have to worry about mold. You sure as hell know that crap fills into those cracks. And you can't clean it. I mean, mildew and stuff is going to grow in those cracks. It's undeniable. And people will say, well, if you have tile, it's hard to clean or whatnot. Yeah. But it's not reaching to anything. It might be hard to get in between tile, but it's sealed solid. It's not like that. It's not like that. I mean, and what's really sad is even when they were over here putting in this crap bar, they did not notice this at all, that this is like this. And even when I sent her pictures and I would have it, she's I'm talking about it, she's like, oh, well, you know, it probably just popped out. And it, it, oh, my God, it didn't, it, there's an underlying reason it fucking popped out, bitch. All right? And I'm not going to go by what you say. I need opinions. I need to know. I think this whole thing has to be redone. That's what I think. I think your fucking beloved to you employees did a shitty job, sloppy, careless, and just thought they would get away with it. And apparently you don't check over their work because you trust them. Fuck you. There's no way that's supposed to be like that. And if it is, I don't see why anybody would ever, ever, ever buy this shit. Why would anybody want something that has that big gap that collects dirt and grime and, and, and mildew in between and whatnot? Even if it wasn't hitting your wall behind. Why would anybody want something like this for a piece of piece, piece contraption? <sighs> this is how it's supposed to be. I can't imagine why anybody would want something like this for piece shower tub enclosure in their home. To me, it's a piece of cheap crap. I never knew this kind of thing existed, but I can't imagine anybody would want it like that.